everybody, this is Alessandra. Welcome to my home. Welcome to my kitchen. We've gradually moved away from the summer vegetables to the fall. And here we have this beautiful bunch of broccoli rabe. When you buy the broccoli rabe, make sure that your flowers are not yellowing. Everything needs to be a vibrant, beautiful green color. Okay, now I'm going to read you the ingredients. It's extremely simple. We're going to use it as a side dish for our chicken cacciatore tonight. So I have extra virgin olive oil, uh, three cloves of garlic, I've sliced them, three chili uh, red hot peppers. You could use less or more depending on your taste or omit it all together. Okay, now I want to show you how I clean the broccoli rub. Very simple. You remove the paper packaging. Andy Boy happens to be one of the best ones we have here in America. Okay, so what you do on a cutting board, just cut the bottom, I'm gonna say just a couple inch up. You don't want to lose too much of the broccoli rub. They're fresh, they're in season, they're tender. This is another thing I like to do with the broccoli rub. With the larger stalk, I take my knife and I go down like this into a cross, okay? Well, that does, it cooks it through and you're not gonna have these hard uh, stems when you're eating. And I don't once I them. split the stems in four, just the larger ones, I'm gonna wash the broccoli rub and then I have boiling water on, meet me by the stove and we'll continue. I have a five quart uh, pot with boiling water. I'm gonna add just a teaspoon of salt, okay? You can go less or more depending on your uh, taste and dietary needs. The broccoli rub right here. Don't worry, they wilt down, so it looks like a lot, but when you put them in, just watch. It goes right down. Now, at the same time, quickly, I'm gonna put my stove on with my saute pan. Okay, the garlic goes in, my chili powder, and my extra virgin olive oil. I'm gonna say about five tablespoons, we're five people. I think five tablespoons is going to do. So that's going to start boiling again. This is going to heat up and we'll continue on. The broccoli have been in the water less than a minute. I'm going to just go ahead and add them right here into my garlic. Cover it up right away so it doesn't get everywhere for the cleanup. doesn't splatter everywhere. Perfect. This is it. We're done. Just give it a good turn. If you like them a little bit uh, more cooked, let them cook for a minute or so. If not, just give them a stir. Make sure they're nicely coated with the garlic and the olive oil. And here you go. You have your broccoli crab as a side dish. You see what I mean about opening up the stems? It's just perfect. I like that little bit of the water from the boiling the broccoli rub. And here you go. It's ready. How long did this take? It took literally less than 10 minutes. And delicious, absolutely. It's definitely quicker than going to your local restaurant and buying it to bring them home. Anyway. Please, I hope you like what you see. Subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell button so you can be notified. Let many, many more recipes coming out. Thank you. Arrivederci. Be safe. Alla prossima. Ciao, ciao.